wait in the session, please. Oh, I can't even contain myself, bro. I'm so excited. There's a lot of guys fishing here. Everybody has the same idea this afternoon. Uh, we're fishing in the north easterly. It's already pumping. So apologies for the audio. And uh, I is at half past nine or nine o'clock this evening. We're gonna try and get a fish before then. Please be. We've got lots of company here. So uh, paddle tails is the name of the game. I managed to get some white ones. Darren also managed. And yeah, we're gonna get straight into this. We'll catch in the water. I'm so excited for getting my manners here. How's it, Darren? <laughs> Darren's also eager to get lines in the water. Ah, it's one of those things. One of those ones. Yeah. Sure. Thanks like to Darren, I'll plan on uh, <laughs> filling this memory card with lots of fish for you guys today. And uh, first class, here we go. Hey. What a pleasure. Let's do this, man. What a lucky color. Ginger. And the water's looking machine, eh? Oh, absolutely machine. <laughs> what are we contending with today? Thankfully, no seaweed. Thankfully. Yeah. Thankfully, no. No debris in the water and all that unnecessary stuff. Just need to go on now. Tight. Precious is just giving me some tips here. What's the story? More, more proud. Yeah. Okay, how do I make it more proud? Then? No, I didn't stick it with two. Parking with Neville and Tertius yeah? Giving me some valuable tips. Oh, jeez, like. Yeah, okay, so it's actually right there. Yeah, Darren also, I was just in a hurry, he's got it. So I must. I'm too deep there. Okay. Try look for a more like a 7 or 7 hole, Yeah. So you got more of a. More of the hook for it to grab on to. My daughter's asking me how you learn all these things, Dad. There you go, Madison. I've just learned from Tertius now. Short, okay. Makes sense. The one that's already ready, the more probably. Yeah? Short, bro. Thanks. Okay. This is what fishing community is all about. Sharing is caring. <laughs> Up already. Try the white one. Try the white one. Yeah. Wanna swap? No, no. Sure. Shot, man. Hey, bro. If I get a fish, credit to you. Ah, no problem. So, as Neville. <laughs> said earlier on a fish this is a fish of a thousand costs or more if anything yeah that's what it takes sometimes and one thing I learned fishing next to them retrieve is very important with the paddle tail uh, you want to slow it down you can actually feel it dragging at the bottom of the the sea pulling through the sand that's the retrieve you want let that paddle tail do the vibration and uh, entice that copy man so slow down your retrieve a bit actually feel it jerking on the floor awesome very lucky evening very pleasant at wind 
drop down nicely full high at the moment and really just hoping to go tight with the cob now this is the cobby that Tosh just got earlier on lucky one it's probably uh, put my rod next to it what is that that's 30 60 90 about 90 centimeters like a cop this is what i can this is what we came for man be so awesome if i can get one on this paddle tail check out the colors what a beauty of a fish well done tush yeah in this point in time we are fishing full high at the moment in fact uh full high will be in the next half an hour to be exact and at this stage of the evening i'm grateful to have met you have quite a few hours man level i met on on the beach tush tushes the guy that got the copy and gave me the paddle tails um, Ian, I met Ian, I met Andy, I met Ashley and Nino, um, yeah, and a lot of other guys I met on the beach. It was lucky to meet up. Still hoping to get a cob, and gonna probably fish an hour or two after the high, and hopefully I get your fish, man. Oh, before I forget, I actually did forget. Binod, welcome me back home. <laughs> Shot, my brother. I hope you got a fish tonight. Guys, if there's any action, I'll bring it to you. Otherwise, I'm going to leave this one here. And I will see you soon. Guys, yep, off for an RV session. Guess what for? <laughs> the elusive cob. Jeez, it's been difficult. Um, I can't tell you how many. Actually, it's been four or five sessions now. And uh, still no cop for me yet. They are around, definitely. Uh, guys have been getting at Sandspit. And that's where I'm headed this afternoon. Darren is going to join me later on. And um, I'm going to try my best to get a cop. <sighs> slim pickings man fishing on the hole has been a bit swack to be honest uh, just one stone bream you saw in the other video but uh, some guys have been lucky oh Neville you know Nev's Nev's got a lacquer brush the other day and uh, and his missus bus of a bronze bream well done and congrats to both of you um, you saw Tertius's cob from the other night and yeah so the fish are there you just gotta be there at the right time i suppose bait in the water as Dick always says um that's when you'll have a chance bro. bait in the water so join me this this afternoon um low tide is at seven bells this evening so i am heading just before it gets dark I'll take the dimmers off just now and uh fish man i said i'm gonna i said to my wife i'm not coming home <laughs> without a cob today and i really 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 hope today is the day so we'll catch you at uh sand spit the flock she's engaging as soon as she stops flashing okay this is all coming out let's go wide Okay, the flop's on. Cheers, Lani. The flop. Awesome. It's just because of this loose sand. You know, and I end up getting stuck. Check what we're doing with this afternoon. How's this conditions? So glad I got you before. Sun down completely. 
Look at this. Absolutely stunning. Oh. Let's make our way to the pit. Welcome back to Sands Pit. Yep, and it's one of those picturesque south coast afternoons, I tell you. There's no wind. Oh. That east is just... Hopefully it stays that way. And uh, we're going to be fishing low anytime now, next half an hour or so. And... Oof. Oh, the smell of the ocean, I can smell it. Uh, calling my name that cobs calling my name hopefully this is the day right let's go get some not bait paddle tails in the water yep so as i mentioned oh let's just check this is locked properly yeah so a lot of guys have concerns over safety here at sandspit uh as i said in the last video be mindful of your surroundings always, not just here at Sands, but look, it is a risk. You park your vehicle and <laughs> that's what you have insurance for, I think. So just make sure there's no valuables, IDs and driver's licenses and that kind of thing. So if they do break in, they're not going to steal your, your valuables. Um, yeah, otherwise, there's quite a few hours here already. Coptoba! All the guys are coming to... Spin. Paddle tail is the name of the game and apparently the white paddle tail has been doing the trick so I've got a couple I couldn't get I don't know if Berkeley makes a white one they make the translucent and the colorful ones got those and I managed to get the McCarthy uh, pure white um, six inch paddle tail and I also managed to get some 7 old jig heads Remember Tertius was telling me my uh, jig head hook was too small the other day So I'm gonna try that out and strictly strictly spinning No bait Darren's also gonna just uh, spin with paddle tail and no chucker or anything like that Because we really we want to catch these cob on this paddle tail man, and experience it I've never caught a cob in paddle tail only on live bait and chocker. Guys got the right idea here. Oh, oh, lack of fire going. Oh, they're holding up a fish. Looks like a Garrick. Yeah, it is a Garrick. Nice, man. Well done, Lanny's. Awesome. And this water is not even ginger, it's rather on the darker side of things. Eh? And, uh, Wow, Garrick, just shows you, bait in the water, that's what counts. So I'm gonna start um, spinning close to the mouth there, and then work my way up um, further north. Not too many hours like the last time. Oh, the Garrick is still jumping around. Looks like they just got it now, no, no. Looks like they got it on the live here too. Awesome. Okay, sure, and this time of the evening, oh man, right, let's go do this, yeah, so there we go, 7, 7 oh, 2 ounce jig head, it's the only ones they had left, no one and a half, I suppose everybody's rushing out for tackle, for the Cobtober run, white pedal tail, remember how this goes, okay, and we don't want to make it too deep we need to put it more shallow so that it's so that the hook's more proud remember remember that's what i was showing the other day and i don't know if i mentioned but um apparently the best time to target cop is just before the low tide and uh, they're more nocturnal than daytime you do get them in the day though you do get them in the morning early hours of the morning i've certainly caught them early hours of the morning as well as the daytime okay one thing i don't have is super glue um so hopefully this holds 
until Darren gets here, I know he's always keeps some in his box. Let's go flick this thing. And while I was busy rigging up this Assassin Spin Zero, I just saw in the corner of my eye something pop up a few times, but looked like uh, it could be a turtle. So I know that's not always great for fishing, because they're fishing as well. But uh, we're after the big cob this evening, so it shouldn't, shouldn't worry us too much. Well, here goes, first cast. Wish me luck, Lannis. Ah, the fish of a thousand casts, eh? I've probably cast maybe a hundred now, since I last uh, spoke to you guys. And uh, if you thought fishing was practicing patience, try chucking lures only. That's when your patience is really tested. Suppose once the once you get results, then it all pays off and it's all worth it, man. But even being here this evening, if I can describe, it's just such a gentle breeze from the shore that I'm feeling on my face here yeah? and um, when the water recedes it's actually like a warm a bit of a warm breeze that's left there's no side wash hardly any seaweed this has obviously been scraping the, the bottom and it's just a pleasant evening All we need now is to top it off with a nice cup. It's about time this all rocked up, man. Huh? I'm two cob in already. Two cob, is it? Two. Hey, luck, man. How are you? Ten kilos. E at least. Yo. Ten kilos of nothing, yeah? Luck, man. Ten kilos of dust. <laughs> Bro. I only got 10 kilos of scuff tea in there. Ah, shot. Oh, this one. Ah, that's what friends are for. <laughs> Bring you a chai and it's still warm. Yeah, it's hot. Shot, bro. Shot now. Laka. I'll give you a chance to catch that cob. Yeah. Yeah, well, it's that one that I told you about as I got you, Garrick. Who was that? Further left there. Yeah. And then, uh, a, uh, what looked like a, like a flat fish just now. Yeah. And then a small cobby. Just now, which on the ox? Bait. All on bait. Uh, all on bait, yeah. Garrick was on livey. Yeah. Um, I don't know what they caught the bad fish on. We'll and check then, uh, as the water pushes in, eh? Yeah. Hopefully. Well, it's, it's, it's low now, full low. Yeah, yeah. Should get some action, bro. Yeah. Looks like it's time to change this one. It's a bit busted Tired. up now. I just took the white one off. Yeah. And I put this oak on. Okay. Let's bug it. Okay. Managed to get some seven O's. Oh, you got? Yeah, two, literally two left in the shop, bro. Luckies? Nope. Um, tackle box. Tackle box and shelly. Okay. Yeah. Two ounce. Like a big hook. Uh, the two ounces are right, but yeah. Yeah. And then. Very lucky. Very lucky. Uh, I had that white one on, but. Nice aerodynamic. Hmm. This is also owner. Must throw nicely. Yeah, it does. Eh? It's, it's also owner. They flip on expensive, these owner. Hooks. They are, they're not cheap. Eh? Jeez, yeah. like. How much were these two? Yes, it's 128 bucks. It's crazy. It's crazy, man. So I bought those for 45 Rand for two the other day. Yeah, what a pleasure. That was that Basil Manning. Yeah. Ooh, I'm gonna go and char this char that you yeah, bought. Yeah, me. yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's. You can start yeah, spinning. No, I'll, ease, I'll ease into it. I mean, no hurry. I probably cost 965,201,010 times. And that's the next one you're going to get the cob. And then the next one will get the cob, yeah. yeah. These are there, I got a small cob now. Yeah, no, no. I'm fishing like this. Back. This thing's staying on my back. Yeah. That's it. Done. That's all you got. Done. Light. You can lighten this load a little bit just now. That's the way to go. <laughs> Shot. You got some coffee there? Yeah, I got some coffee. There. Nice. Fresh from Rwanda. <laughs> like it. <laughs> You reckon? Yeah. yeah you surely wrap this, huh? <laughs> They're a bit saucy, that's what Oh, okay, so... Yeah. You must be careful. I'm just 
gonna tear into those clean graphics, eh? Please guys, I can't ask you enough to please throw your rubbish at home. Take it home and chuck it away at home. Don't leave it on the beach, man. This place is filthy, eh? It is, eh? Yeah, it's filthy. Yo, oh, I feel like I'm unwrapping a Christmas present here. Unboxing. <laughs> Unboxing of what what did Darren bring here? <laughs> oh, it's smelling lacquer. <laughs> this in his crowd. Oh, now this is what friends are for. Check out this thing. <laughs> oh my goodness. Shot, bro. Ribs. <laughs> Not just any chow, Lani's. No, we don't. We do it in style, Lani. Shot, man. Mm. Let me taste. <laughs> Ooh, how's that? Mm. Lack of flavor? Yeah, because I, mm. they weren't lucky. They were very bland. No, they're lucky now. Put a bit of this and that. And hopefully they improved a little bit. Mm. Short, you bought me a... What's this? A 400 gram portion here, bro. It's about 600. 600 gram portion. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> mm. Short, Lani. Yep, nice and duck shot. Thanks, Darren. And uh, got a few. Do another thousand more costs this time around. I put on this uh, yellow Berkeley Ripple or Shad Ripple, whatever it's called. This thing, Ripple Shed, Berkeley Ripple Shed, that's what it's called. And there's a slight drizzle now with a sardine. Maybe that's a good thing. Let's check it. I'm on, I'm on. Yes, cost number 455 million, 126. Thanks for sticking with me through the series, Lannis. We're on. Yes. Nice head shakes. Beautiful head shakes. Oh, yes. There we go. How's this cob? Oh, yes. Short. Darren, grab the camera here. That's the one, Lani. Oh, this is the one, bro. That's the one. Well done. See the In the mouth. There, eh? Well done. Shot. Top, top, top. Close by, yeah? Nice, Kens. Beautiful. Get, watch it there, watch it. Get a hand there, Kens. Nicely done, Kens. I don't know, is it Kent? No, it's rolling. Yeah, it's rolling. Here we go, guys. <laughs> Here we go, guys. Wow, well done, Kent. Beautiful, healthy little cub. Lovely fish. What's Careful. Um, what's the rod there, please, Ali? Huh? I'm gonna get my rod there. What's the rod? Good. Okay, good. Okay. Huh? Sorry, sorry. And this is a little guy that got the rod. What's your water can? Come up a bit, Ixay. Come up a bit. Come on. Come on. Nice, sir. Put the rod down there. Put it down. Shot. Shot in front of the door. Static. Lacquer fish can so well fish, bro. Awesome. <laughs> Nicely. How's this bro? Probably at seven kilos? Seven. Easy. Yeah. Come closer. Wanna take a snap? To the ripple chad. Wanna get this fish in the water quickly? Yeah. Just wanna take a photo. Get a nice I got you, I got you. 
Let's go. Also back in. Next one. Well done, bro. Top, 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 shot, bro. Like I get another one. Huh? Oh, there we go. It's your turn. Well done. Nice Thanks, bro. And I was just gonna put the and it took you in the shallows, bro. Ooh, right as I got close to the to the bank, yeah. Hey, what kind, Nick, sir? Yeah. Where you been, bro? We've been fishing all over. On that side? Yeah. How's it? Any luck? Yeah, I got one. Hey, well done. Like an end to the series, bro. Well done, well done. I'm gonna put my... It's three videos I'm putting together. Yeah. And, um... What a way to end it, bro. Ah. Like yeah. a one. Yeah. Probably a little bit smaller than the one you got the other day. Ah, that's like a... Like a one. At least you felt it now. Yeah, paddle tail, bro. Uh, so, who am I talking to? Neville and Tertius, the guys that gave us advice the other day. And what a way to end this three or four parties. I can't remember. So, overstock, bro. I hope I'm not casting a shadow here. But I just wanted to say, shot to Tertius again and to or Nevs for the tips um, two days ago. And you saw it paid off. Shot, bro. Oh, it's only the big thing, bro. <laughs> Many more. Many to more. Hey, Many more to and what a feeling! Uh. Yeah. Uh, shot, it's always bro. the best. And we'll catch you on the next one. Yeah, definitely. Cheers. Cheers, cheers. Yeah. So Sands Pit delivered the goods on home ground. <laughs> hey, and uh, it's definitely a fish of a thousand cars, bro. Yeah. Shot, like it. Cheers, cheers, cheers. Shot. Nah, no, kids, that was well done. Yes, you were determined and uh, paid off. In the Have to always pay off. Eh? Proof. Law of averages, I think. Eh? Yeah, that's 100% true. Law of averages. Uh, I happened. think, what did I say? Four sessions in here at Sandspit. Yeah. Over the different days, different conditions, different tides. We've been uh, learning. You heard you saying shot to the guys there. Everybody's saying, on the low, before the low, how about you take on the low? Well, this evening it was pushing. mid pushing, yeah, pushing tide, pushing tide. Uh, rather late in the evening, yeah. just before 10 bells, and not on the white paddle tail, on the orange one after all. The ripple shed, the ripple shed did the, the trick, yeah. and it was just right place, right time. That's all yeah. it was, really. Yeah, that's it. Next time will be yeah. my turn. For sure. Absolutely, <laughs> for sure. But for now, we're gonna just rest these oh, these arms. <laughs> my left arm, jeez, just, like it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah and uh, another thing is, um, look, I'm not an expert. I'm nowhere near expert. I'm still a amateur fisherman. Um, but this is a nice fish. I could have easily taken that fish home. There's nothing wrong with taking with taking fish home. But uh, leave the undersized ones, guys and uh, the ones over a meter the breeding stock we saw quite a few undersized fish come out this evening the guys are just taking them yeah, um, yeah, guys don't yeah, they need to learn it's it's if i'm going to show you spots um do me this one solid clean up after yourself and don't take undersized fish take fish whatever you need stick to the limits yeah. the bag limits size limits bag limits yeah but please man um, and also yeah you saw me picking up a few things there around us there this place is absolutely filthy guys uh, it's a simple one we're not going to be able to get bins here never not in a hundred years not 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 quickly anyway so the the quickest solution is just pick up off bring yourself a, bring a black bag good to see you brought your black bag today. yeah but i keep I one to, in my, I need in my to get bag. In the habit of keeping one in the bag too yeah so yeah, yeah, leaving on a high note, 
<laughs> Thanks for watching all the videos. I'm glad you you sat through all of them. Um, and in the end it paid off. So if you like these videos, please remember to like and subscribe. Hit the bell. Hit that bell. Short <laughs> Okay. Good one. Cheers. Catch you guys on the next one.